Hey, what is up, everyone? Welcome back to the end of the video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to root any Android device without using a computer, without unlocking the bootloader of your Android device, without using any custom recovery like TTP, 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 without using any custom recovery like so as I just said, I am going to be showing you step by step how you can get root SS on your phone without using a computer, without using any custom recovery like TTP or B or anything like that, without unlocking the bootloader of your device, without hiding your device, without deleting anything on your phone, you will get root SS on your phone easily. So uh, let's get started by making some change on the device, go to setting of your device, scroll down to the last option about phone or about device. Now what you're going to do just to find this option saying build the number, click on it around seven times to activate it the developer option. Just to click this option build the number on it around seven times. You are going to activate the developer option. I have you already activated the developer option. Just return. Return and find this option saying developer option. If you are not seeing this option on the setting of your device, just click right over here on this icon, the cheese icon, right over here in the corner to cheese. Just click it on it and type there developer option. You will find this option available here. Just click it on it. By doing that, it will open. If it is disabled, just a for example, if yours it is just like this disabled, just enabled by clicking right over in this icon, click it on it to enable, click it OK if you ask you. Make sure to enable this option saying USB the picking mode, click it on it to enable, OK. Scroll down. If you if your Android device you have one gigabyte or two gigabytes running on your Android device, you need to enable this option saying for GPU rendering. And if you have a four gigabyte or a gigabyte or higher, you don't need to enable this option. Just enable this option if you have two gigabyte or one gigabyte, right? All right. Now I'm going to be showing you. That my Android device have no root access. To do that, I'm going to be using the application called the root shake. The link will be available in the description of this video if you want to know as well. The root shaker. Alright, open the root shaker. Then it's going to be just like this. What are you going to do? Just click right over here on shake by doing that. The application will search will find and it's going to tell you if your phone have root access or not. Just click on it. Wait a little bit as you can see. Now root it. Don't worry, I'm going to be showing you how you can get root access on your phone easily without using a computer as I have just said. Alright, then let this application the link will be available in the description of this video. Vamos Pro Premium Mode. Download the link will be available in the description. Download, install it on your phone, extract the file using this application that I'm using. The this one over here to extract the file. Because this is the last version of this application, then load extract the file. Have you already extracted by clicking right over here? Replace the file. Install this application. I have it already installed, so I don't need to install it anymore on my device. Install the app. Once you have installed the application, you need to download a room that we are going to be using to get root access on our Android device. The link will be available in the description of this. A of the room that I'm talking about, download this room. The link will be available in the description. This one over here, download. Once you have downloaded, just to create another folder on the on your phone. Another folder that by clicking to create another folder, just click right over here on this icon and click right over here. And what you're going to do, just to name it this folder like this, almost bro. Just like this and click it. Okay, I have you already did that. I have you already created the folder. This is one over here. Create the folder. Open it up. Here, create another folder and name it as backup. As you can see right over here, like this. Just name it like this. Open it up and import the room. Download the room and copy it. Put it in here on the backup folder. 
just to do as I did right over here. Okay, now you can return. Open the application, the buy most polarized version. The link will be available in the description. Install it on your phone, open it up this application device pro. I'm going to add the room that we have it downloaded. Just click right over here on add virtual machine, just clicking on it. By doing that, it will open this window. What we're going to do now, just click right over here on this three dots right over here in the corner, right over here. Clicking on it. Now, just click on the first option saying Rick virtual machine, clicking on it. By doing that term that we have downloaded will be available on here. So you can see, just click on it. By doing that, it will ask you this. Just click right over here on start the work. By doing that, the application will start recovering the room. It won't take too long, just a three minutes, one minute, depending on your device. Just be patient a little bit. Right, the room now is pouring. Just to wait a little bit. All right, as you can see, a the the room has booted. This is the light version of a. This is the light version of this room. It's customized it it's pretty cool just to download the link will be available in the description of this video i have just said now just to open the setting of the a room of the vimos click on the setting icon scroll down to the last option we are going to disable some option about phone or about device i mean about emulator device click on it a make sure to enable this option will the number Click on it around seven times to activate the developer option. We want to disable some option. As you can see, you are now a developer. Just to return, find this option saying a developer option. Click on it. Scroll down. All right. You need to disable the Windows animation scale. Just, just this one over here. Just to click on it to disable. Animation off. Do the same with with the transition animation. Pull it off. Just see right over here. Click over here. Do the same with the animation duration scale. Pull it off. Right. Okay. As you can see, the root shaker is already installed on this customized room. The exposed installer as well is installed. The Play Store is as well working on this room perfectly. I'm just going to show you. I'm gonna be. A, I wanna open the root shaker just to find out to show you that a, this has root access. Open the root shaker. Click right over here on agree. Swap to the right. Swap one more time to the right. Click right over here on get started. Click right over here on get started. By doing that, it will be just like this. What you're going to just click right over here on verify root right over here, and it's going to start to verify, and it's gonna tell you if your phone have root access or not. As you can see, root shaker prompting me. Just click right over here on remember if this is happening to you. Allow right over here in the corner. As you can see, congratulations, root access is probably installed on this device easy and simple without a uh, using a computer without having my device without using any custom recovery like TWRB or anything like that so if you want to close this room if you want click right over here on this icon the virus icon click on it you will have this option if you want to stop this just click right over here on stop if you want to minimize it you can click right over here on minimize it easy and simple okay guys i will start from you this video help you out if this video help you out please leave a like and subscribe to my channel if you are not subscribed i leave the notification to get notified about new video and i'll see you guys on the next one peace out